I was born a boy alone, being good and fearing others. I was born a boy alone, but I found. But it, the title could also have been Band of Brothers. Mm -hmm. uh, because it's about the boy alone, like the lone wolf, and it's about the end of the lone wolf, you know, like through men's circles, like to, to find each other, support each other. I was born, boy alone, but I found a band of Hello, my name is Clay Boykin, and I am in search of the new compassionate male. I believe in the midst of these incredible times of change, a new compassionate male is emerging as the new archetype, and this podcast is intended to give voice to both men and women on the overarching topic of compassion consciousness in men. Finding that the, the, uh, Patrick has told men they are certain, they are certain way, and so they, they, they don't show feelings, they, they are not supposed to you know, all those things that have, have buried the feminine in them. Lead us into understanding and recognizing not just the in-your-face patriarchy, but those subtle um, mm -hmm. ways we contribute to patriarchy. Your uh, invaluable project uh, on, in the, on the level of having supporting men in their process of becoming more whole that's such a crucial part of this of this uh, overall um, challenge that we're that we're that we're in together. We can hold that tension of opposites and, and leverage that the diversity that we both have that we can bring to it and aim at something greater than either one of us. You know, I, I, I feel that we go back to power and as white men who we have power whether we know it or not. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that we who have that power step outside of our comfort zone and use the, the positional power that we have to invite others into the room. There are no other priorities that are more important than bringing this value forth culturally and individually. And that is the kind of leaders that we need who have a will, who are very clear, but who are also intuitive, who can listen to the heart, who are very nurturing, empathetic, caring, who understand the interconnectedness of life and at the same time have the capacity and will to make things happen. Compassion is not a nice to have. Right. Compassion is not a soft skill. Um, I learned uh, later another way of, of framing it is it's a harder skill or a heart skill we've lived with the deep wound you know and and we need to own that that the masculine you know energy and and body has often been you know um, a tool of violence the difficulty sometimes is how we transform that intent that uh, dream of a better humanity into action yeah what a wonderful place to leave it right there for what would you tell, if you could meet Clay from eight years ago, what would you tell him of the wisdom that you've gained? All the others. I was born, boy alone. Wow. But I found a band of brothers. Have compassion for myself. Oh, wow. Now that I'm at peace, my lonely hours light up like a flame and now that we're at peace we'll share this flame with our sons and our fathers and now i'll go out into life being me and freeing others yes i will if i can Help tired brothers out of the darkness.